I uh, I told y'all I'd be doing the Tackle Warehouse unboxing day, and although it's kind of late, here it goes. First up, we got the Savage Gear 3D Clawfish, 3-inch spleen clawfish color. It costs $9.99. You gotta buy a specific hook to go with it, but they are just so realistic. I bought them, and I'm trying them out. Next up, we have the River to Sea Clacking Clayfish. It cost me also $9.99. I have it in the red 90 color. It's also extremely realistic and it comes with an extra head just in case it gets broke or whatever. It's pretty cool. Now we have 1175 feet of 12 pound chai line, big game line. It only cost me like. I think it was like six bucks. I think either s no, excuse me, like nine dollars. But it was a great deal for how much you get, so I got it. Now we got the Conquistador Conquest jigs. Um, it comes with a trailer and it's scented with some type of scent. I think. It's in the bluegill color. I just bought it to try to walk around some rocky ledges and stuff, try it out. It was cheap. Only two nineteen, I think. Oh excuse me, three fifty nine. But uh looks pretty cool. I'm excited. Now I got the um what was it called? The Outcast Pro Staff Jig. One eight of an ounce black blue for one ninety nine. Kinda looks like the Conquistador jig. And to go with it, I bought me some net bait, the go to bait. I got the packer chunk and the tiny packer chunk. And I got these in the Toledo and the black sapphire. This one being the Toledo and this one being the black sapphire. Now I got the Z Man 10 times tough Elastitech crawfish. Um, yeah, this is a resellable bag, so I'll open it to show y'all. Pretty neat looking, pretty realistic. You know, you just set it along the bottom and just jog it along, and it's supposed to be naturally buoyant, so the claw should rise up in like a fight position. Should jaw some strikes. Smells like it kinda scented, but uh, it's green pumpkin colored. Seems like they try to put a scent on it, but it kind of smells like they kind of run out and all that, so, yeah. It's kind of a bummer. Thought it would have a little more scent to it than that, but I can add my own scent. Now I have the Kicking Bass Fish Attractant. Smell the best, now smell the best. The most powerful fishing attractant in the world. Kicking Bass, coffee 529. It's in the crawfish smell, so yeah, that's why I got all these crawfish things to go with this. And then I bought the smelly jelly in the bait fish smell to go along with the bluegill and the crappy that I got in one of my earlier videos from Tackle Warehouse. Something leaked in here. Gonna have to fix that. And of course, with all orders of $50 or more, you get the Tackle Warehouse sticker. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. Now, I just wanted to point out that these jigs are real cheap. However, the hooks are sharp and they're real durable. 
these right here. Here's the rigging options for them. And I'm not gonna open it. Gonna let my dad open that one. For I think that he want that he wants to open it. I'm gonna open up the black sapphire bag and show y'all the trailer for it. Here you go. Kinda looks like a crawfish. Is it scented? It, yeah, it's got a scent, some type of scent. I have no idea what the scent is. It's covered in salt and has pork fat. That's what the smell is. Huh. Better not sit that on my floor. Don't want my room to be smelling like pork fat. But that was the black sapphire. And here's the Toledo. A tiny chunk. Pretty cool, same scent and all. And here's a good look at what you're supposed to rig it on. If I could get it open, I'm sorry. Can't seem to get it open. There we go. It's tournament tested, bass approved. It's got two rattles, if you notice. Here you go. Here's the two rattles. Got a nice little weed guard going on here. You just lift it up, put the trailer on there. Then put it that back down there. It's a pretty neat little jig. I think it's, it's got like 60 strands on it, so that's going to be pretty cool. All this cost me only $54. And, yeah. Make sure, I just want to point out that the River to Sea is just a lot realistic. A lot more realistic than I thought from what I heard about it. Gonna pull it out for the time being. Look at that. It's pretty neat. As you move in the water, this tail will make a little noise right here. You can either jock it along the bottom or you could. Do a steady crank on it. They were even nice enough to throw in an extra head because it's soft. Just in case it breaks, they threw it in there. The rest of the body's hard, it's just the head that's soft. It's pretty neat. Y'all should buy pretty much every River to Sea product that you could. Believe me. All these River to Sea products, all them people that say they don't work must not be using them right because these things work like magic thank y'all for watching make sure y'all like comment and subscribe and i'll see y'all next time which will be a lucky tackle box open opening